everyone what is good welcome back to the channel this is silver hyena and my bouncy camera and then again i'm pretty sure that those of you who are regular here are already used to that anyways what we have today are these pen plus gear colored pencils i got these during one of walmart's back to school sales i think almost two years ago at the point of this yeah, um, I just found these randomly while I was looking through my stuff going, hmm, what video should I film tonight? And this was drawn, so let's see how well they perform. I got old reliable, the sketchbook here, which I've actually almost filled out this thing. I'm very proud of that. All right. First, let's get this open. No, I'm not just tape, but this thing, it's, ah, jeez. Like the stupid flap got stuck. All right, there we are. Nice colored pencils. Let's get one of those lovely pour shots. Perfect. Alrighty, so here we are. Let's take a look at the barrel here real quick. Um, honestly, there's not really a whole lot. Um, you have the color name in multiple languages and pen, pe I almost said pen plus, the pen plus gear. Seriously, I thought that these things were supposed to be alcohol free. Sure doesn't feel like it. But it is tasty. Mm. Ah, tea break. Uh, anyways, um, let's just try these out. Oh, whoa. Okay. Honestly, I was not expecting much from these. But for super cheap colored pencils... Honestly, that's not too bad bad. I mean, like, it's no polychromos, but it's not too bad. I also forgot I had these when I did my color pencil comparison video. But I guess that's besides the point. Because I'm always finding new and unique things and then losing them and then rediscovering them and then they're new again does anybody else do that or is that just a me thing alrighty so i'm gonna finish up these swatches and then i'll carry on with an illustration i mean you know the drill right, get back in order Okay, so here are the swatches, which, like, you know, I don't think they came out too bad at all. Um, the blending, uh, blending was just kind of, uh, okay. One thing I did notice about these pencils is that they seem to have a pretty hard lead, similar to those, uh, Bic color pencils I used a while back. Um, if you're curious about those, I will have a link in the description below and one of those little eye bubble thingies pop up on the screen. However, for the time being, I actually want to compare one of these. Actually, I'll probably use this obnoxiously bright green because I see another green one. Okay, yeah, that's pretty similar. Like, these ones are the uh, Crayolas. This one is yellow green. This one is light green. Eh, close enough, I think. So I just want to 
do a side by side comparison. Just real quick. Because, like, Crayola pencils, as far as cheap colored pencils go, not bad at all. Okay, so there we are. And I also do think that the Crayola lead is a bit softer, closer to more of like Prisma color. Like I said, these leads feel a bit harder on the uh, the Pen Plus gear. Okay, so it's like I would say that overall the quality, it, it's definitely similar. Definitely similar. I mean, like, it's not the greatest, but it's usable. And now it's time to really see what these things can do. And I got, like, the mess on the paper when I did that stupid pour shot. That one was, that one, that one was bad. But, yeah. That's, I, I don't know where I'm going with this. Um, anyways, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna draw something now. Okay, so here we are, just kind of just having fun with kind of a low pressure doodle page, trying out all of the colors. Overall, I found these to be okay. I mean, like they're definitely not groundbreaking. I think I paid maybe two bucks for them, which for $2 colored pencils, not bad at all. Not bad at all. Like. 
I, I was having fun with this. I mean, like, I'm not sure if I'd run out and buy a bigger set or anything, but, like, you know, they're, they're usable. It's a good kind of sketch or doodle set, I think, especially for the cheap price. Um, no broken lead, so that is a huge plus for pen plus gear on that. Anyways, with all that being said, I certainly hope that you have enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. This is Silver Hyena, signing off. Stay creative, everybody. Bye!